Uh, rice gum, you're f irrelevant. Don't tell me I'm irrelevant uh, unless you want to actually throw some hands. So. Oh, that one felt like it. Oh, that hurt on so many levels. No, you ain't my girl. This ain't breakfast at Tiffany. She texts me at 3 a.m. telling me that she missing me. I am pulling up because it's 3 a.m. Turn that down, turn it down, turn it down, turn it down. I've been holding on to that song for probably three months now. So I thought it through. And if you guys can get my boy, Dylan Matthew, the creator. Betty on my lap, six nine shift, night in all day. And we do it and we kick out the f 100,000 followers on Instagram. We're gonna put his Instagram on the screen right now. Get him to 100,000 followers. We will drop this song tomorrow on my YouTube channel. I'm not normally gonna post tomorrow, but I will. I will post this song. We'll release it on Spotify. Why are you just standing there all quietly, bro? Do you want 100K or not? I'm listening. Do you want 100K I'm followers listening. or not? I will dump, where are they? One gallon of fake blood over this guy's head. Okay, can I <laughs> jump in your pool after? No, you can't. You I really can't, because this, this is like syrup, bro. Without further ado, so enjoy good. the rest of the vlog. It's someone's birthday. Ooh. Oh, there's so many good options. It's Mateo. I know Mateo loves cake. Like these. Oh, he would love these, bro. This is his favorite flavor. All right. Should you gonna surprise him? Man, I'm He's excited. Gonna so He's gonna be so. He's gonna really love our friends like a lot. More, more than anything, really. Our yeah. friend really loves cake. We love our friends too. So. We love our friends. We like helping helping our friends out. I love cake. He's 18 today. Is that right? He's a good guy. Alrighty, I think I can finally say. Good morning, Fox fam. Welcome back to another vlog. I hope you guys are all having an amazing day. You know it's gonna be a busy week. We're prepping for Africa. Someone called me out. We're gonna get to that in a second. I, I got someone I need to talk a little shit on. Uh, but for right now, it's my friend Mateo's birthday. You guys all know Mateo, but uh, it's his 18th birthday today. We went out, got him a cake. We got him a nice little birthday card. Check out the check out the beautiful humor. That's good, that's good. You think my friend's gonna like this? Haha, <laughs> the hamster. Yeah, I mean, all I really have to say here is that we just love our friends, so we'll catch you guys when we get home. All right, welcome back to the T Fox compound. Come on, did you really think on this YouTube channel that we're just gonna give him a cake? We gotta prank him a little bit. He's in the backyard. He's in the back. Be quiet, be quiet. He's in the back. We're gonna go smash it in his face, so just follow my lead, right? Mateo, the birthday boy. Hey, what's up? Hey, man. Happy birthday. How old are you today? I'm 18. Guys, Mateo's 18. I think it's time. I'm not gonna lie, bro. We, we, we got you a little something. From the house. Bro. Yeah, we did. Look, bro. I, I don't want to say too much, but we got you a really big surprise. I don't know if you're ready, bro. Or you want to blindfold him, Johnny? What is it, bro? All right. Uh, That's a good blindfold. Okay, blindfold him. And, it means, yeah. and then I gotta go. I have to go get the present. Listen, before we give this to you, all right, you've been at this house for about a month and a half, two months. We all love you. You're like you're like family to us, and we all just so you know we all pitched into this together. Your uh, hand out, dude. I'm shaking. I'm so excited. <laughs> all right, ready? Yeah. Feel it, bro. No way. Take the blindfold off, bro. No way. Take the blindfold off. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday! I got him a card. I got you a card. You wanna open it, bro? No, you got it's your card, man. Happy birthday. <laughs> what just happened? I don't think any of us thought that through because now look at the mess we created. Bro, my face is like crusted. <laughs> it's actually really good though. <laughs> is it pretty fire? Well, not a car, but a kick to the face. Kick to the face, kick fight. Close enough, dude. We had a kick fight, we had a food fight. Uh, what do like you say, uh, maybe we. Rinse off, yeah. We all go jump in the pool and maybe hold a big rock. Oh, like... Maybe rock run. Like, we could go in the water with a big rock. It's fun. I know it sounds stupid, but it's really fun. No, yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Cool. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, we're moving on from the vlog. So something I like to keep in mind is that there's a lot of there's a lot of younger children that watch these kinds of videos. So I always try my best to kind of put things in your perspective so that you understand them. And today's topic is that you do not need drugs to have fun. Am I right? 100%. You do not need drugs or alcohol to have fun. And listen, this is a very expensive toy. Um, this is something that we do instead of drinking alcohol and doing drugs. Uh, this is what we like to do for fun. So a lot of people might not be able to afford this, but just hear me out, okay? All right, so this right here. Uh, 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 some might think that this is a rock, um, but it, it is in fact, it's a rock. We actually picked this rock from the side of the yard right there. Okay, now this is what we like to call rock running. Listen, we're gonna take this here rock, we're gonna go in the water and have fun. That sounds crazy, but check it out. All right, this is how it works, guys. Also, ignore the fact that the pool's so dirty. Our pool guy is clearly not doing his job. <laughs> Um, I'm not normally this type of youtuber, but today I'm gonna be this youtuber um, as you guys know There's this there's this guy. He's uh, kind of he was on the come up. He's kind of falling off now His views are only at 31 million uh, Had a pass with quite a few times you guys might have heard of him rice gum uh, So I addressed this on my Instagram like last week and then I realized that the video that I was addressing was posted five months ago But anyways, I'm gonna address this really quick. Um, rice gum said this I've actually been challenged by like guys like you know Tanner Fox and like Road to Shaw, like these kind of like irrelevant YouTubers in a way where I feel like it wouldn't motivate me. Now he wants to sit there and say that he does not want to fight me or the other dude because um, we're not relevant enough. I think that's an excuse um, because you couldn't even last five minutes in the Ace Family basketball game. I don't think you have the stamina to fight someone for more than two minutes, let alone play in a basketball game or really ever do anything athletic in your life. So Rice Gum, uh, if you want to fight me, if you want to box um, at the Logan versus KSI rematch, you are the only person I will personally train, I will work out, and I will beat that ass. And if I don't, you get to knock me out. If you want to knock me out, I want to add that I'm not afraid to get knocked out. I think with a fight with that many people watching, I'm not afraid to get knocked out. I've been knocked out before. I've broken countless amounts of bones. I can take it. But do not call me irrelevant, boy. You are irrelevant. If if we check, should we check his social blade standards once again? Let's check the social blade. Irrelevant. Right there, it says 31 million views for the month. What, what's yours again? My my monthly views. Yeah, what's my monthly? monthly views are. I don't know what he was talking about with that. Come up with stupid excuses. I guess that's my reason. If you if you don't want to fight me because you're scared you won't last, just say so. So that's that. If you want to see me fight Rice Gum, go comment an L on one of his posts or something like that. Anyways, we're gonna move on from that. That's the boxing drama of the day. Okay, so um, I wanted to think of a creative way to incorporate scootering in today's vlog. I know you guys love, I know you absolutely love when I have scootering in the videos. So I decided, what trick could I do? What do I want to do on a scooter? And of course I want to try to flare flat because I just learned that while I was in her. So we pulled out the air track. This is basically a makeshift resi. So we have, we have the resi pads underneath and we have our Turf on top. So, <laughs> I'm gonna stand in place on my scooter, try to flare flat. I don't know if it's gonna work, but we're gonna give it a shot. I, was trying to race, I just don't know how it's gonna go because your deck sinks in, so I don't know if when I jump, if I'm gonna get the flick. But I guess we're gonna find out. I mean, it's right, to the ready? point where like you'll never feel comfortable, right, so you right, just right, have right. to do it. I know, I know. All right, ready? Go. This is the one, guys. This Box fam, one. drop a like if I send this. <laughs> Oh. oh, that hurt on so many levels. What? That didn't work like you wanted it. Oh, I, I stopped upside down. You good? <laughs> Oh, my head hurts. That so was a bad. horrible idea. <laughs> Whose idea was this? It was this? my idea. <laughs> Are you good? That fucked so bad. That failed so miserably, I told you guys. I, At least they dropped the uh, like because you sent it. Uh, I sent it though. Hey, you you sending it, though. Uh, th this is the problem. This is, the, this is where it all went wrong. So everything was fun in games, okay? Everything was great. Everything felt fantastic until I went to jump and my front wheel sunk in. 
and didn't let me go anywhere and I landed upside down on my head. So you're gonna go again? No. So we, we spent 35 minutes setting this up for that. <laughs> so I could land on my neck. Did you watch that? Yes, sir. Entertainment? Um, I don't know. I like worried about you guys. Did you really, like, like oh. when you got on it, were you for sure it was gonna work? No, I thought it was, I was like, I don't know how this is gonna go. But you already did it, so you already, you already said you were gonna do it. Exactly, so you had to do exactly. Ah, uh, you did it for hurts, the people. My head hurts a little bit, but we tried it. You yeah. learn something new every day. Thanks for watching that, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. <laughs> All right, air track did not work. Okay. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Well, I am thoroughly impressed. That worked very well. Well, I think it's safe to say that that air track uh, didn't, did not go in my favor. I landed on my head, my neck and my head hurt a little bit, but I think we'll be good. And that was probably a lot more damage than rice gum could ever do. So I think, I think I'll be ready for that if he's, if he's ready for that. Anyways, guys, that is gonna wrap up today's video. As you know, I talked about in a video a few days ago, I am headed to Africa. That is right. Well, actually it might be South Africa. I think I'm going to South Africa in like two days. We are going with the Ace family. Uh, Popcorn will be there. My filmer Zay will be there. And I am going to be attempting to film my very first documentary. I am so excited. I've never done anything like that. Also, I want to know, I want to know what you guys thought about all the new T-Fox shorts in today's video. You guys can see that right now I'm wearing the, uh, the pink and blue ones. All the shorts that we were wearing in the pool outside, those are all the new shorts. And I actually have them finally ready after six months. So they can drop really whenever you guys want them to. So comment down below when you want the shorts to drop and what you think about them, guys. Okay, this is what the next two days look like, okay? Just so you have a little idea. So in two days, I'm filming a video confronting someone that I'm kind of nervous about, and uh, I don't know how it's gonna go, but I don't wanna say too much because in case they're watching this video, I don't want it to throw it off. Um, and then the day after that, I will be going up in a hot air balloon, okay? So I'm going up in a hot air balloon. We're gonna be dropping stuff out of it from different heights. We have a few things already planned, but I wanna know what you want me to drop out of the hot air balloon. So comment down below crazy weird thing we should do with a hot air balloon because we have it for pretty much the entire morning. I'm renting one, it's just me and my friends going and we can kind of do whatever we want for it. So comment down below ideas you wanna see with the hot air balloon from crazy heights. Like we're gonna be bringing this thing up there. Like when I say hi, it's a hot air balloon. It goes as high as we want it to. So enough talking. It's just nice to kind of chat with you guys. Anyways, I I'm getting really nervous for Africa. There's a lot of time going into it. We had to go get shots and it's going to be this giant ordeal. So I'm a little worried. I'm a little scary, but I'm also insanely excited to like kind of film the experience and the raw, raw vibes and like just everything going on. I get back from Africa September 6th. And then after that, we have the GTR reveal. So that'll be a big deal as well. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Let's roll the Fox fam. What's up, guys? It's Samantha. Go give this video a like. Go subscribe to Tanner and be part of the Fox fam. Also, get your merch at tfoxbrand.com. Without further ado, let's roll the outro. Love me, me real tight when I'm shaking. Cause the she know I bleed too You was like a puppy, put that Peter shit all be you